you guys are asleep, we come to work. We get here about 10 o'clock and we leave around 6 a.m. before you guys even go to school. Hi, I'm Alice and I'm another producer here. One of our main jobs focuses just solely around the computer. Um, we use EMPS to write our scripts every morning and, um, and research stories. Um, we also, we get a video, we'll pick out video, we get it from a number of different sources including our own local photographers as well as sources like Newspath, which gives us video, it gives us access to video from all over the world um, that we can bring to you guys. And during the show, our main responsibility, we sit here in the booth, our director sits in front of us, and we time the show, and anytime there's any new stories to come in, we write them real quickly so that they'll get into the teleprompter. And now I want to introduce you to some of our co-workers, and they're going to tell you what they do here. Hi, I'm Angela Taylor. I'm a news anchor at CBS 17. And I'm Rod Carter. I'm also a news anchor here at CBS 17. So I hear you guys are doing a career day and want to know a little bit about what we do. So, Rod? Yeah, so every day we get to read to people and let them know what is happening in the world. And sometimes we get to go out and interview those people and we have to hold a microphone and to talk to them and all that good stuff. But really what we do is talk to all of these cameras and through those cameras, we're able to tell everybody what's going on in the world. And we do a lot of writing too. So if you love to read and you love to write and you love to talk, then maybe being a news anchor on CBS 17 could be your future career. What do you think? And I always say that if you're really, really nosy, mm. make that work for you because I am extremely nosy and that always helps when you want to be a journalist because you like to ask a lot of questions. So there you go. If you guys are interested in being news anchors, let us know. Hi everybody, my name is Todd Gibson. I'm a sportscaster here at WNCN. Uh, normally I don't dress this well, but tonight I had the chance to anchor. I was in front of the big board here reading out the teleprompter. Most of the time you'll see me with a camera on my shoulder, running up and down the sidelines of football games or sitting on the floor at college basketball games. But the thing I like to do most of all is to go out and shoot feature stories, high school feature stories mostly. I love to get out there, talk with the kids and see what they have to say. Feature stories are what I do mostly. What I'll do is I'll shoot those things, bring it back to the station, put the video on my laptop, and from there I will make a story coming together, voice it, write it, edit it, and put it all together. That's what I love to do. Love being a sportscaster. I once interviewed Michael Jordan one-on-one. -on -one. That's my claim to fame. So if you want to be a sportscaster, it's really cool, but there's a lot of work involved. And uh, it's just, it's fun to do, like I said, but there is a lot of work, but it is very, very rewarding. Kids, stay in school and study hard. Hi Riverwood Elementary School students. My name is Brea Hollingsworth. I'm a reporter with CBS 17 and I'm here to tell you about what I do just as a reporter. So right now we are preparing for our live shot. I just got out of the car and met with my photographer Peyton. Peyton, say hi. Hey. Peyton, tell, tell uh, them a little bit about what you are doing. Uh, I am the photographer. I am Peyton on TakeOver. This is the camera that I use as you can kind of see. It is. I'll let Bray get over there and kind of see how we would set up the shot. Kind of zoom in there if I can. There we go. And I have the task of making Brea look good on camera every day. Very we, we're the dream team together right here. <laughs> so that's a little bit about uh, what we do eat every day. And of course, I hope you guys have a great day. Bye. Hi, I'm Marissa Williams. I'm a director here at CBS 17. And back here is where I get to move the cameras. Amber, Miss Amber, tells me what camera shot she wants where and when. And I make that stuff happen. We have some graphics that we use. Hey guys, it's CBS 17 Chief Meteorologist Wes Sohenstein coming to you from the main studio and the giant big board where a lot of times I do my weather forecast. This video monitor is almost eight feet tall and it does a great job of showing weather graphics, regular news graphics, or even news video. But in order for me to go from one graphic to another, I use this remote control, which will allow me to take the radar on a wide view close up into central North Carolina where we all live. And not only do we like to look at radar, but temperatures, and I can take you from temperatures in central North Carolina all the way up to temperatures in Alaska where, check this out, it's 14 degrees below zero in Dead Horse, Alaska. Wouldn't want to be there right now. But the main studio has a lot more than just the giant big board. It's got my standing weather position where I sometimes go to cover severe weather. We've got to do homework every day. We've got to study the weather to create the forecast. 
and we do that back here in the weather center when it's time for the news anchors to do their job they're up here at the news desk and of course none of this can happen without the use of our fully robotic cameras these allow us to look good on TV, which is half the battle. Each one costs close to $100,000 though, so save your money if you wanna buy a TV station. And we can't look good without lights. Just like when you take a picture sometimes and you need a flash, we've got all these lights to help light us well so we look good on TV when it's time to do the news, sports, and weather. So that's it from Studio A here at CBS 17. I'm Wes Owenstein. Hey everyone, I'm Laura Smith. I work the morning show here at CBS 17. I handle traffic in the mornings and I also am on the weather team. So this is what you don't see on TV. This is the green screen and allows me to pull up several graphics and stand in front of it. I can't wear a green dress because that won't work, but I use this monitor right here. I use this monitor over there and you can see the camera. We can turn the camera. I use that as well to guide me through on air work so pretty cool stuff and when there's a vehicle crash i help your mom dad going to work maybe taking you to school get around that vehicle crash that could be causing some issues on the road so we do a lot here in the morning but we have a good time and good luck with all of your adventures maybe you want to do tv one day it's a fun job but definitely one where you got to wake up early if you choose to do the morning show my wake up time two in the morning have a good day Hey everyone, my name is Mike. I work at CBS 17 on the assignment desk here. My job is partially to make sure that everything goes smoothly behind the scenes. You look at all this fun looking equipment here, this is what we use to make sure that the reporters out in the field can get from where they are on air and your parents can watch them at home. Now a lot of my job means managing the digital content for the station. That means looking after the website, our social media pages, and our news app. If your parents don't have this, please tell them to download it. Because next time it snows and we send out a push alert that you don't have to go to school, there's a chance I might have written it. My job is a lot of writing, but I love writing, so that is pretty much my favorite part about it. And I also love that every day is kind of a little bit different than the last. Hi, I'm Andrea. I'm a director. Today I'm working on the floor. So here we have the prompter, so I scroll through so the anchor can read it. I can also control the cameras, so I use these robotic controls. We have a bunch of pre-saved shots here, so I can like select and send cameras all over the studio. And I'm also responsible for relaying anything from the director out to town on the floor. So it's pretty cool stuff. Hey, I'm Tom. I'm an audio operator at CBS 17. Um, this is an audio board, and this is where all the sound comes from for the, for the news anchors and sound effects and music. Hi, I'm Jared. I'm an editor. I'm responsible for editing all the video and sound for the morning newscasts. Um, pretty much anything that you see on TV that's not live on camera has to go through me. I use the computer all night long to do my work. And uh, sometimes it gets a little stressful, but it can be a lot of fun. Hey guys, my name is Joseph Holloway. I'm a reporter and anchor for CBS 17 here in Raleigh. So I want to tell you a little bit about, first of all, how I got to this point. So I went to college, got a degree in journalism, and then I worked at some TV stations in Arkansas and Oklahoma. And then I came here uh, just over a year ago. I've been doing this for nearly 10 years now. Hey guys, I'm Randy Ayala. I'm the morning anchor here at CBS 17, and I also report too. And I'm Bill Young. I'm her co-anchor and I also anchor our new newscast and I want to give a shout out to our friends there at Riverwood Elementary. You know, it's pretty fun to do what we do. You learn about current events mm -hmm. and you get to talk to a lot of interesting people. Yeah. And you're on TV every morning, although tell them what time we get up. Well, I set my alarm at 2 a.m. Mm -hmm. I have about four or five, so it's like in five minute increments, so I'm here to work on time. We have to come in at 3.30 in the morning. Yeah, I was going to say, I sleep in a little bit <laughs> till about 2.30, but uh, I've been doing this now 19 years, Wow! and you've been doing about what, five? Yeah, five or six? Yes. about five years. Uh, we move around a lot. You live in a bunch of different cities. Five different cities. Yeah, uh, we pack up and move. And uh, we enjoy what we do, it is fun. You know, so when we come in in the morning, we work on scripts, we look at scripts to make sure we have, you know, what everyone's talking about in the, in the rundown, which is what we call um, the list of stories that we include in the right. show. Right, yeah, and we have people that help us so that we know Mrs. Langston is the one Aww. who gets in overnight and mm -hmm. works her tail off to make sure that we know what's going on so we can pass along to you guys. Yeah, um, Bill, anything else you wanna add? You know what, just read a lot, know what's going on in the world, and you two can be a great 
communicator. That's always something, no matter what you want to do yeah, when you grow up. It's a it's, great skill to have. It's important. All right, bye, guys. This is CBS 17 News this morning. Good morning. Happy Good Tuesday. Morning. It is March 15th. I'm Bill Young. Good morning to you. I'm Randy Ayala. Thanks for getting your morning started with us. Want to get over now to meteorologist Bill Ray? Bill, looking at